Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, I just woke up. I'm a little bit late to class right now, but I'm starting the day off with S23 Ultra at 98%. So right now, I gotta go pack up my stuff real quick, and then I gotta head straight to class. I'm gonna take the skateboard, and I gotta get going on, so I'll see you there. <laughs> So I just got to class. The S pen's down there too. Camera's better than mine. This is my good friend Mike. Uh, he also uses a lot of Samsung phones, so I decided to give him the S23 Ultra to see what it's all about. Like the red. As you can see, we're just kind of playing around with it, being good students, listening very carefully to what the teacher is saying. But uh, yeah, he just bought a PlayStation VR right in front of me. This guy's pretty ballsy. But yes, yeah, so we're just reviewing material. I think this day we're talking about stroke and the signs and symptoms of one and how to code that. But yeah, we're taking more pictures of our friend Garrett right here, just playing around with it, being the best productive students as we can. <laughs> All right, so we just got out of class, and then we're gonna take some photos right here, right in front of our lovely school building. I'm gonna take a picture of our beautiful young man here, Garrett. And Mike now. And Mike now. Oh, God. We're gonna try out 200 megapixels on the main lens. Oh, I like that, boys. <laughs> All right, turn on, turn on, turn on. I don't like the model today. <laughs> I haven't replaced some ugly shit today. Feels so okay. So this recording. Oh, that's pretty dramatic. It brings me in the, the high school photos. Right after yeah. school? Get one it takes a little bit of post process. Yeah, you can see the, the other one's definitely better this one. What do you think of this phone, Mike? Just, I mean, I've had my S20. It's yeah. a little bit more squared off in the edges and all that. Yeah. Otherwise, a little bit better on the grip. Oh, yeah, because it doesn't have the fucking edge display like that and they're more sounds aggressive. It used to be fucking super, and this thing used to be a lot thinner. They thickened it up, which they should have done. It's... I know my hand's shaking, but it doesn't show up on the camera. The camera's steady. I know, like, I'm shaking. Yeah, it's how image stabilization. Yeah. This is uh, 1.6K you're holding in your hand right now. 1.6K and 1.4K. She just land that on the ground. Oh Three, 3K, 3K. Hard really working, good. blood, sweat, yeah, tears. It's not this. bad. Hmm. I mean, like, it's, it's all right. It's a normal Samsung phone. I like them. They're good phones. The camera's a little bit thicker than last year's model. I mean, yeah, that's because they were having issues with my phone. All right, so I'm going to try out the 100 times zoom out here. If you can see that, you got City Hall there in the distance. I'm going to pull up the S23 real quick. Alright, so I'm using 100 times zoom, it actually does a pretty good job of holding stabilization. As you can tell, I was holding it with just one hand, and the AI was trying to kind of lock onto that one building, as you can tell. As far as the photo goes and how practical the 100 times zoom is, I'm not too sure how often you would use it, but I guess it is a nice feature. Fast phone. Yeah, I mean it's an upgrade in terms of like the software, at least in like yeah, the other general performance. Personally, I think my phone has like that held up well. It has a very nice feel to it. I mean, maybe I'm just used to it too. But yeah, this one's just like a little bit slimmer too. I feel this one's like really chunky, like in terms of like, width. But you have the S10 Plus, right? I think that was like the, the flagship back yeah. in the day. Alright, so I just reheated some clam chowder and I'm actually going to get into editing the video for the S22 versus the S23 Ultra. By the time you see this, it's already been posted. Yeah, so class really wasn't that bad on Tuesdays and Thursdays. I only have one in the morning at 9.30 until 11, so I'm free basically throughout the rest of the day and I can just do whatever the heck I want. So I've been editing for about an hour and then I took a quick nap for an hour and then I just woke up. So I'm getting back into this, but I'm actually gonna go get some food right now. I actually didn't really sleep too well last night. I didn't sleep until like three in the morning and then I woke up kind of late and then you saw me uh, running to class uh, at like nine in the morning. So I think I'm a little bit rejuvenated. That clam chowder soup was good, but I still need to eat more. So I'm gonna head um, down to Chinatown and get some food and then I'm gonna get right back into this. It also looks like it's raining outside.
yeah, this place only takes cash, and I was like 40 cents short, so I was like, yo, um, is it fine? She's like, yeah, just don't worry about it. She was super nice, so I got uh, soup, as well as chicken, pork, broccoli, rice, and a lot of other things, all for seven bucks. Honestly, this is one of my favorite places to go in Philly. I just want to get home right now, I'm getting a little hangry, and get back to editing this video. this just for seven bucks it's quite a steal honestly if you ask me you get soup broth and chicken and oh my gosh this is this is something to, this is something to savor I'm almost done editing this video and honestly, I'm really enjoying it. Um, I think this one, I, I really like going out and skating that day with my friends. We honestly had a blast just going around the city, testing out the S23 versus the S22 Ultra. Currently my timeline is honestly not that bad. My PC is just getting a little bit hot so I had to take some of the casings off. Put that over here so the fans could start blowing in. It's currently 518. I did go on Instagram a little bit here and there, I was working too. I really like the display on this a lot. I think this is um, one of the nicest displays I've seen in a while. The fact that it's really just cutting edge to edge here. And the 120 hertz looks amazing on it. The problem with having these super thin bezels on these phones, like if you're kind of holding the phone like this, maybe your thumb kind of hits the side of it sometimes, but I haven't felt that much of a problem. It did happen quite a few times, but it is one downside to notice if you're gonna be making phones with these thin bezels. All right, so I finally uploaded the video. Uh, I had to wait a little bit for the rendering and the processing on YouTube. It's currently 7.55 and I meet my friend over at the gym. We're gonna get a quick pump in. And I guess in the meantime, I'm gonna wait outside and get some pictures at night and see how we're doing. But as for a quick checkup, but we're looking at 75% right here, which honestly isn't that bad considering how much video clips I was taking and then scrolling across social media, used it to Google some websites and write a few notes here and there. You got shit to do. I go lock some classrooms, but. So just ran into my friend David and I'm actually gonna be walking today cause it's gonna be raining soon so I don't know if I can take the board out. But I might take some photos here while I'm at it. No clue why the police are on campus right now. What's up? They don't. Pretty good, pretty good. There's a bunch of pops. What's happening? I don't have man. Today, cause like it's gonna rain soon. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Okay, that's why I put out my mud guards. <laughs>
Anyway, I'm back. I was finishing up some work. I think the last thing I'm gonna do tonight is just kind of rest and relax. It's uh, 12.54 a.m. It's kind of the next day now. I'll check the battery life one last time for you guys. I ended at 61%. I think it'll be much higher if you're not using the camera as much as I did today. I mean, I was putting it through heavy usage, just videoing everything. I'm just kind of playing around with the settings that they got here. This is a photo that my friend took of me the other day, which I think is pretty dope. They got a lot of like, adjustments, spin effect. <laughs> That's kind of crazy. But right now, I'm gonna put this phone down. <laughs> Too much screen time today. If you guys like this video, make sure to hit the like and subscribe button. Let me know if you guys want more day in life videos like these. I honestly have a blast making them. Just kind of show you guys my user experience and a realistic point of view. And kind of show you and bring you along as part of my life as well as a phone. So, hey, I'll see you guys in the next video.